Thanks for tuning in to Make This Happen, where we discuss an idea we've been dying to see come alive. Every week, my friend, Jay Yi, and myself, Alex Gonzalez, will bring you a product you never knew you needed. Now let's get started with painting. Most specifically, I want to hang up art. I want to ikea painting. And what I mean by that is there is a way that when you build your own furniture, you take a certain ownership over it and you like it more. Well, what I want to do is sell canvases with specific amounts of paint included, and it'll have a guide where there's going to be some kind of technology that lights up underneath the canvas that so you can color it in. And I then you see. can make beautiful art. So, so you want like a, like a coloring book, but for the purpose of you hanging it up, essentially, is the idea. Uh, correct. Okay. I like that. That's I, absolutely correct. I dig this. Um, and then I want there to be levels. So there can be beginner, medium, and then advanced. And that way... If you want to and you get into it, you can start making more and more advanced pieces of art that you are proud of. Okay. I have two ideas uh, to build upon it. Um, the first one, you mentioned something about lighting it up. Why don't we just make it like a coloring book where we have like, there's like obvious areas where, you know, you're supposed to color in to like a, like a stencil almost not a stencil, but like very faint lines, like kind of like guidelines on where to paint. What if we have a sticker material that's easy to peel off that's on it. And there's like little labels. I see. So you're thinking more like, um, like building a gun and dump. we can have it. So <laughs> where there's like, no, 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 not like that. We're on the canvas. They'll just be like, you'll color in like a section, then you'll be able to peel off like the line. So that way you can color inside the line, so to say. I see. Okay. So like you're but thinking. But this is going to be a little bit more advanced. It's not coloring because you're actually going to be painting. Right. So it'll come with um, the Well, that's the point. So e since you're painting, the lines will eventually disappear. It's not like colored pencil where you can't, you can't not color over the oh, lines that's true. you that's know what true. i mean you're painting over yeah. this thing so the yeah, lines yeah. will disappear so you don't have to like have it so the lines peel off i mean that would make a cool effect if you like peeled off the paint or all the just like peel thing off and then the paint turns lines into off. something else yeah um i mean that could be one thing that we do is paint it whatever colors you want and then oh, you peel yeah. this thing off and then it'll create a abstract art piece with different colors of what now, you used I want to also with this company launch a YouTube series alongside it where there's a personality that paints with you. Yeah. So if you additionally need more help than just the instructions, there'll be someone there. So you actually kind of read my mind. I don't want it to be like a YouTube channel. I want the, the painting that you buy. So let's say you go into a Walmart or a Target or wherever. You go to the arts and crafts section and this is just sitting there. You pick the painting that looks the most appealing to you that you want to hang up, right? And they, like you said, different levels of difficulty and stuff like that. You take this painting home, you open it up, there's a canvas, there's all the paint that you need and some extra in case you need some extra. And then it comes with... By the way, you are right. I did I did Gundam I did gum Gundamify painting. Now that you're explaining it to me, yeah, I totally <laughs> did that. I made I made painting gumpla. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, master grade, I was going a different, grade, different direction, different but uh, no, yeah, this is definitely like buying a box set, but for painting. Um, but yeah, it comes with like disposable brushes, paint, and all that stuff. But it also comes with a QR code on a piece of paper, right? You scan this QR code, and it'll bring up a video, and this video is going to have like a personality that. I wouldn't say walks you through painting it like a Bob Ross situation. I'm thinking like it'll be a technique you should try. Be like, hey, 
try using the sponge here and then you can make this effect try using this here and then you could get like try yeah, painting in this using it stroke on the painting yeah and then you could get like so that you can see the real example right and like different uh, textures of the paint on how you're painting it like using a sponge or like using a special motion to give it like a different look but not like a step to step so it's still up to the art your yourself your own artistic way of doing it like you could follow their suggestion or you could just do it how you want to do it you know um and maybe there is a step-by-step -step thing maybe what it is the video will start off with like here are the techniques that we used in order to create the painting that you bought and then after they show you all the uh technique the painting techniques then they do like a bob ross step by step how to paint this painting thing so there'll be two videos someone the basic steps for someone who just wants to just try it and go for it on their own or yeah step by step they'll guide you they'll explain what they're doing how they're doing it and guide you through it type of thing or you could just this forget this all together and just paint is... it that's true this is one of those episodes where I wish we had some starting capital because this seems like something that could work. Yeah, I mean, like people now, pay to go to like a like a color me mine or whatever those places are called. You know, this is just and taking because that to of the quarantine. Home. Mm -hmm. Yep, and then we can do different series. So, like at different beginner, advanced, intermediate levels. Like in the beginner levels, we can do a watercolor series mm -hmm. where then there's just watercolor paints out. And then do different um, different techniques or different mediums that way. Right. But why stop at now, painting, like, painting canvases? Like, why stop there? Why not have, like, a jar series or, like, a cup series or, like... Um, oh, my gosh. We're just going to be the hottest shit at joann's and michael's <laughs> we are gonna rule that store <laughs> yeah so we'll just have like a craft section like is what you're telling me like now i'm thinking about it so like a jar series uh what else? hey to to freaking a, a special release from this product right you you we sell people like little little figurines right and we teach how to like miniature paint, like paint small things, you know, how people like to paint like yeah, yeah. mini versions of whatever, you know, like uh, someone would buy. Miniatures? A, yeah, like a tiny, I don't know, I'm thinking D&D &D right now. So like a tiny orc elf or something, right? And then you just paint it because they come plain. Yeah, or like there's like Warhammer and stuff. Yeah, and like re uh, not recently, but not too long ago, like in the early two, 2010s, um dunnies were or dunnies but kid robot was a big thing and people would just buy plain kid robots and just paint over them you know and that was a big thing for a so little while. <laughs> yeah no while i was growing up uh my grandma would buy little statues usually of animals a lot of times frogs and we would end up painting the frogs hmm. and then putting our own colors on them so i do remember that yeah, so it'd so be kind of like that, but more like that. We'd have to see what to sell. Yeah, yeah, it'd just be more guided, where it's like, hey, I would here's want to our with Pokemon for the 25th anniversary. Yeah, and no, then you just... but they have their yeah, no, we could include their own colors. What do you mean? So we could do one where there's where you get a Pikachu yeah, figurine, it's just... but it's blank, and then we include all the paint needed yeah. to paint Pikachu, like yellow, tiny bit of red, and then like some brownish black, brown like dark brown exactly i dig is it is there i mean obvious obviously we can do mugs and uh so we're not doing the light anymore right it's just going to be coloring lines like i don't think so because if there's a light that means there's an initial purchase necessary that means it, they have to buy this thing yeah. that projects the light and it also has yeah, to be able to it. like connect to a cloud or like the internet or something like that so already that's boosting this price by like 100 bucks mm -hmm. um but if they just buy the frame and it just comes with the little qr code we could charge like 
25 to 40, depending on the size of this canvas, you know, uh, instead of having them buy a light first. And then at that point, it becomes like a easy bake oven, you know, where it's like you buy this thing and now you have to supply this thing. But if we sell the canvas with the video separate and then maybe some guidelines that you paint over, um, that's just, hey, it's like that's like more like buying a Lego where you're like, hey, I like that. I want to make it. You buy it and you make it. Um, or you buy like you buy a bunch, you know, um, whereas the the having the initial buy of buying a light up projector would probably scare away some people where some people would be like, Hey, let's just buy it for the, for the fun of it. You know, just, let's just see if we could draw something. That's true. We, we want a low cost to entry here since we're providing paints and stuff. Now I want to know what's the most advanced paint painting going to look like? Like what can we do there? I mean, I what, think, what can we supply our top, our top people who want to get into it? Do you think we should go a little bit more of an expensive route and include more quality things with it because at that point you're you're kind of ready to invest no i think what we could do for or less what do you mean because they're so good at painting that they probably have their own supplies so they don't want our basic stuff they would just want our paint right? no Instead because if you're if you're actually a painter you probably won't even need guidelines or anything like that but like what I would think you would have to do when you get to the more advanced paintings, um, it's, I mean, obviously it's not going to be water paint anymore. It's not going to be paint paint anymore. You're, you will probably supply like oils or like um, the, uh, the other type of paint that's like really chalky um, or like, uh, like we'll probably introduce new painting, like new types of paint and also different types of brushes that use that paint differently. And then that's where you could start making the more complex paintings that you get in like a, I don't know, like a re Renaissance piece, which is mostly like oil on canvas, you know? Um, so you probably just work with different materials. Like it's not going to be paint when you and I would go and, and, and try to buy paint. complicated techniques. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, that comes with painting with oil or painting with, um, I don't know, something else. I'm not, I, I, I'm not super great at art and my sister is my only reason you know, where I know these type of things, but yeah, like once you start painting with oil, think. it's like way different. Oh, this is making me think that now if this launches, this would be great to donate to schools, right? Like this is the kind of thing they love. Yeah, I mean, our product is basically like a be like beginners kits like that or student editions. I mean, I think it'd be more popular with like the young young crowd. Like I I could picture like maybe second to fourth grade might buy a beginners to a, a intermediate oh, level. And I, because it looks not that shitty, the parents will want to hang it up even more. <laughs> exactly, you're so right. But Instead like, of just like a crappy like thing. Once you get to like fifth, sixth, seventh grade, at that point, you want your kids to, um, if they're artistic, you would want your kids to do your own thing, make your own style, draw your own way. Yeah, so they wouldn't want to follow a, a, a coloring book, essentially. You know, at that point, they want to do their own things. So I could definitely see this for the younger crowd in schools. And I also see it commercially for people our age where they're uh, young adults who have their own places to live and they want unique art to put up and maybe something that they made themselves type of thing. Um, I don't see in between because if you are painting at that age, you're probably an artist. And if you're probably an artist, you probably don't want to follow a guide. You know what I mean? Um, just yeah, yeah. having an artist siblings, both my sisters are both artists. I, they've probably made unique creations since they were in, yeah, like fourth grade is when they started actually painting and drawing stuff, not, not guided. So around that age, you would probably stop. Like school programs probably mm. wouldn't supply at that point. I see. So it would be, it would be best for little kids, but still a really good product for them as well. Canon, Kodak, who does this? Canon. Thing? I have no idea. Make <laughs> this happen. Crayola, you mean? I 
Cray- yeah, Crayola. Canon's photographs. Thanks for listening. Right? I don't know. I think you, you said Kodak too. You said you said Canon and Kodak. Kodak makes film. You'd like to see talked about. Feel free to write in at, at poundgames at gmail.com. We have a Patreon. If you'd like to join that pound family, come find us at patreon.com slash we are not game devs. Patrons receive episodes two days early, meaning make this happen gets to your ears that much sooner. If you enjoyed our show, take a second to give us a review. We're on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Google Play Store, and more. Catch you guys next Sunday with Jay's idea, which is fantastic, and it's going to be... Board games. I gave you... Board games. Wow, that was so defeated. Board games it is. Board games. How about cards? I want to play Solar Spire. I want to play all the games.